Hi guys, welcome to IT Networking and uh, how to download buzzer DCP T520 W driver. Okay, so open any browser. Firstly, come on Google page. Type brother DCP T Pi two zero W driver. So guys, right click to new tab, which is first link support support and uh, download top like this. Open. So guys, we have this is uh, we can download from the drivers. So this is Windows, Mac, Linux, and for mobiles. Okay. So we have to. Install for Windows. So guys, firstly check your operating system. Windows 10, 11, 11, 8.17. So I have to download Windows 11 and then guys click to OK. Then guys scroll down. So guys, uh, there are two types of, this is full setup with software, full driver and software package and this is only for drivers. And this is also all uh, printer driver and scanner and with USB. So, which you want to, you can download from there and more than tools available. So you have firmware update and like this, okay. I have to only simple. So click this and scroll down. And hold. now this is downloading. If this setup is not running and facing some issues, so you go to control panel and uninstall your old printer drivers. Okay, and then try. So how to try it? Click to start button. Type control panel. Firstly, you uninstall old driver if you have to trying to view by category select and uninstall. So all brother driver is uninstalled from select and then uninstalled. Okay, so download this one. Click to launch. Then guys, click to run. Now this is install extracting. Okay. Otherwise, guys, you can download full driver. Scroll down and download. So guys, double click to open, run. C drive user ID. This is actually locations, and you can run from there. Then guys, click to yes. So this is installation software portal. So you can choose your look, uh, languages, your country location language. Then guys, click next. I accept the license. Next. So guys, there are two options: Wi-Fi and by local USB. So if you want to Wi-Fi, so it's easy. Also, this is also easy. Please wait. Your system, your system is scanning to printer. Cannot connect to machine because I don't have a, a printer to connect this. So back, you can select next step wireless and enter the IP address which is your IP address and then connect. Okay. Then next time, this is very simple steps so we have to complete. Okay.